the drug menace. The, the container uh, project at the harbor and all that, they were part and parcel of setting it up. They take figures of what comes in, what is going out, what arrests so we are making, have the tribes. So this publication? No, it's not. This, this, is, this is just a straightforward news okay. report. I don't have the figures. But I'm saying that what is said here, which was September 2008, if you read this report, which is between May 2007 and December 2008, you will get the understanding of why this man was saying so. Okay. That was, this is not to say that there were no loopholes or lapses. That's not what I've said. Unless he's talking of how much they are doing today, he's not suggesting for a moment that they've closed the door to the trade no. because it is occurring. Mm. And here we are discussing this particular matter. But sure. Can I make a point? The point about drugs is like prostitution, it's like all crime. Mm. It will always exist, and that's why you always have police forces and security agencies working. At certain points, certain offenses can escalate to a point where governments or institutions have to take an extra effort to stamp it out. Mm -hmm. And that is why we are saying that or one of the issues that came out, and I don't believe, I mean, notwithstanding the arrest and the work that was done, at the very least, there was a perception may not be reality, but at the very least, there was a perception that the drug trade that had occurred in Ghana in the period of the, uh, the, between, say, 2000 and 2008 had escalated to a point where it had to be dealt with, and that's why even Operation Westbridge came about. So that's the point. Wait, no, wait, wait, so wait. That's the point. Alex, yes. is there a contrary so, perception now? I believe there is. There is. There a perception to I believe, the no, I believe that the perception now is that efforts have been made strongly demonstrable by even the, the, the example set by the president oh, himself. Oh, well, come with it. No, wait, I'm saying... What president uh, Listen, being said that like the what, what, what is that? The empty populism. Let's but talk wait, serious matters. No, 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 please. Kweku. What are you talking about? I'm talk How many presidents are, are put in that manner? <laughs> it's even degrading very, of very. the office of the president. Globally, it is not recognized. It's not done anywhere. But it's a matter when of... He, Kweku, no, no, but listen. When Kweku. he gets to the other jurisdictions, why doesn't he get himself searched? Because it's not right. They will be shocked. If the Ghanaian president invites U.S. immigration to physically say, they will not even do it. It uh, is not done anywhere. It's, it's demicry. It, that has no value as in international is, diplomacy. No, 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 no. Can I please? Take it from me. Uh, okay, Alex, I Alex I have, you have one minute. And Kuku will answer. I think that Benjamin, no, Kuku, Kuku, come Kuku's on. diminishing of this matter is unfortunate. Look, how many I've of the ministers said, and the rest do the same? I mean, this whole thing is a joke. Kuku, let him land. I'll give you the opportunity. That thing is a joke. Kuku, you know, thank you. one of the reasons why... I respect the why president a lot, but this one, I'm prepared to say it is a complete joke. Very well. One Noted. of the reasons why governments have suffered is because of the perception that the government uh, officials, the diplomatic bags, and so on and so forth, have been used in the... Uh, are you aware there was an interception in London not too long ago? Actually, there's a text. We, uh, you, you know that? No. We go on diplomatic back. So you know that? Let me, With a seal on. Let me, let me. In under this administration, yes. We How much of this thing should be published? Well, you see, my point is this. If you want Alex, to you have to land on, in one minute because we have to move. But they keep interrupting me. But because it was you, no, no, you, you, yours is an interruption. <laughs> You're interrupting, so you have one minute. Have you finished? Yeah, yeah, cool. Well, then let people land, and I'll interrupt him afterwards. Okay, <laughs> okay. Let him land. I, I don't. I mean, I know what the point I want to make. And, and just a quick text message. I just yeah. think it will be useful to our discussion. I don't know who this is, but the person says, "Tilly, is Alex saying that drugs has the drugs war has been won? You should go and read today's Daily Mail. Check the online edition from your studio." <laughs> Who has said um, that the drugs war has been won? Which reports that 80 million pounds worth of cocaine was recently impounded in Accra, involving a syndicate of four Britons and a Ghanaian who imported it into the United Kingdom from South America en route to the UK. Okay. That's good news. <coughs> That's good news. Okay. Uh, so let's, let's uh, take it's been going on. Uh, it's, been going on. Uh, it's been going on. We've been fighting but it as a nation. Oh, oh, the fact oh, that we, we have yeah. more arrests. <laughs> Is that necessarily a guarantee, which is the point I was trying to make, that doesn't necessarily mean that we're winning the war, no, or is it no, that we no, just have tightened it so that no. the loopholes, we yeah, can but, cut yeah, a lot yeah, more but people? What else can you do? 
it appears that we will never be able to eradicate it in its entirety. That's the so point I make. It's not possible. We continue to delude ourselves into thinking that no, we're making progress. Reduced. It must no, be reduced. No, no, no. We must but fight for it. Right. You can't you can you can make a statistical check on that. Yeah, by saying that, that you are arrested reducing. more people, yeah, so you're doing well? It is good to arrest more. It's good to intercept. It shows the efficiency of the system. It is good. Arresting more is good. It's not mm. bad. But That's if, the first if, thing. If, if, if the system is saying that people still don't fear and they're even trying to bring it. No, so the that human nature has been what it is. This trade, the people get addicted to it. Okay, there's a market out there. Even America, with all its enforcement things, are they not suffering because of the Mexican threat? Yeah, that's they're true. suffering, let's be honest. But it is still we a demand and it. supply thing. I mean, one of the good things you have to check you. Your, your, on, on it is the price. And I have made a statement here that the price of cocaine has gone up. Have you been in Ghana by some? Recently? Did no, let's buy some or ask the number. Uh, no, intelligence. Go and check with Nabuk. No, I just asked the no, question. Right, I don't know the price of cocaine has gone up. We have to move in Ghana. Right? What in Ghana? <laughs> no, no, you haven't, you haven't landed yet. <laughs> when did you become a terrorist? <laughs> Why did it? <laughs> For me, as I said, mm -hmm. and I'll be honest, largely I've resisted that temptation. It forced me in that direction. But you have I, been there, Kuku. You have been there. No, I, I, I was there. To, no, no, no. I went there to make a point. To the make the point made. against what you and Mr. Menu had done. Oh, we hear you. In order to establish the point that is not the right thing to do. Okay. But of course, it's a question of improving on our institutions, perhaps improving on our legislation. The the big no built-in was part of the experience. It came out from the experience. But I think what this also teaches us that maybe we should improve how we store. Those things. Fantastic point. In the Kodwama committee report, it's there that even the police institution did not have an effective storage facility or exit room. And indeed, I suspect, I, I'm told, I haven't read it, uh, seen the facts, but the Americans are helping mm. to put up such Something a facility, like which okay. is ongoing, maybe near but why do we have to well. store Let's hear Benjamin. Gentlemen. No, the, but the, the law was passed when you can destroy. Yeah, exactly. You are the lawyer. I'm yeah. told, I'm told. It, in you the give law. the defense and the prosecution no, enough until time to have after testing. Appeal, I'm told. Check. But there will be yeah, but because if the person wants to appeal, yes, but they should. No, but, but once you leave the sample, yeah, the sample is what we are talking uh -huh. about. But you don't leave the parcels. The sample is what we are talking about. Because that's what somebody will steal and take. I say we are talking of court, so I was looking at the sample. Yes. Okay. No, the rest is to be destroyed. The regulations are there, but the sample that goes to court. No, Ben is not the lawyer. The sample that goes to court. I'm told cannot be destroyed until after appeal. Okay. You can check with lawyers. Because during who, an appeal, they can uh, seek retest. They can still retest and Which is things. why it's uh. strange that in this case, in, in the course of the same case, that the judge granted uh, the request for retesting. Because there's nothing wrong with that. Let me ask you a question. Uh, the lawyer is here. Is not, no, you can, like I said, there mm. can be reasons why he wants to retest. That's right. Even if it's for delay. See. He can decide, that, look, I'm not happy and retest, and it will be done. That is why the. Even though he didn't object to the initial. Results from the being the next day was for me a bit of an issue. No, but because no. you can't just look at the substance and decide you want a retest, especially mm -hmm. when you already have a forensic report. Look, I had the, okay. I had the, the lawyer making mm -hmm. a very interesting case. Mm -hmm. Assuming it was a land dispute, a land litigation, yeah. and you brought your documentation that you claim this is your indenture and all yeah. the rest, yeah. it's, ad, it's, it's uh, given to the court. Everybody accepts it. That it's, it's admitted into evidence. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is not. A confirmation that I accept the authenticity okay. of yes. what you it brought. Means that yes. you can still in go course, back in the course of the trial, I can come back to say this thing is a forgery, and then we do authentication to yes. realize it's a forgery. Yes. So, in principle, in terms of the trust of the law, there was nothing really wrong. The fact case. that they all admitted into evidence was not an admission that that was authentically the cocaine you brought it up. But it depends. Court. No, but that's law. It I'm depends. talking law in this. Right. Especially when it was I not tested in court. If the culprit had actually so requested for that test, Who? if the person being tried, tried, yeah. right, comes out and says, look, let us go and do But that's what the defense counsel did. That's why. Exactly. So, so that is where we are raising our questions. If it has come voluntarily from the judge, no. that would have been a different no. matter. No, I no. think the defense no. have a right. The defense have the right to do they that. They can ask. Okay. But they, if the you're whole lying, you're listening out there, we'd also like to get some education on this, so you can send us a text. Let's hear Benjamin, who yeah, joined us yeah, a while but back. But not until I make a little protest. I was informed of this program 30 minutes to time. I Apologies just for that. Producers take notice of it. They've discussed the fine details of this issue, mm. and I think it's completely unnecessary that I go all over it to all listeners. I think that the level of animosity which has greeted this issue between the security agencies is very nasty. It doesn't look tidy. There seems to be suspicion 
these are bodies that are supposed to work together. I'm talking about the police, I'm talking about the court systems, I'm even talking about NACOP and all those who have to do this. Now, if they believe that among their ranks, one wants to do them in, one wants to sabotage them, then this is very serious. I am just hoping that when this rigor exercise of clear legal processes are done with, and we know the corporates, there will be fine systems put in place to also see how best they can come back on track and work, because they need to work together. Yeah, but if, if you feel that you need to exonerate yourself, then by all means, shouldn't you do that? Precisely. Even if it's at the expense of, you know, a partner with whom you work, because if the stigma comes, it sticks on you. I agree, but that, 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 that exoneration needs to be done. But when it stretches, the animosity stretches, it's going to be at the cost of other things. That is their cooperation to achieve better results in other areas. Because they are always, it's a policeman who protects the judge. It's a poli they are always working together. So they need <coughs> that level of uh, cooperation. I think that the menace of drugs, as I have listened to my, uh, the, uh, the previous speakers, have always been with us. The point is, the response, the approach, how swift it is. If you look at the high-level approach, right from the uh, office of the vice president, and because I, I assume he's the acting president, the fact that concurrent committees have been set up. How many committees are there now? Because I, if I remember correctly, the vice president asked the police to discontinue. Yeah, but I think the BNI... The so BNI, there's BNI and then the, the, the one set up by the court. Chief Justice. Yeah, but I also believe that the police committee have just been told to be on the ice. It, 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 can, it can be reactivated after some of these...